Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Articulate. It is Jake explaining words of my choosing to Paul. He cannot say the word, he cannot say words that rhyme with the word, and he cannot draw the word or make sounds. He has to describe them. Are right. you people ready? Ready to go? Yes. Off you go. OK, uh, if, if you want to, you've got passwords for websites, but if you want to make it uh, more secure, you add this in. Uh, HTTPS? Uh, I don't know. So, uh, so you, you log in, you get a, an SMS or something, and that's called? Oh, two-factor. Uh, give... Two-FA? Two-factor Yes, yes, yeah, you said it. Um, OK, um, the, the fans of Vim really hate this text editor. Fans of Vim. Emacs? Yep, thank you. Um, Oh, OK. Um, on on a, a joypad, you've got um, the analog sticks, but you've got another thing there to do directional stuff. The D-pad. D-pad. Um, huh. Thank you, Summer. Uh, OK, so um, at the at the end of a line, um, you, you will sometimes leave some punctuation. Like, if, if you're doing an array, uh, you can miss one of these out uh, on, on the last item, but I, I like to leave them the in comma. there. Yeah, but if it's... Um, it's um. It's kind of just hanging around there, isn't it? It's sort of like the, the, the trailing comma. Almost, it's kind of like sort of hanging off the edge there, isn't it? It's just sort of. I have no idea what it, this is. Like, if you, uh, so, it's, if if you were sort of um, holding onto a, a, a cliff edge, you you would describe it as like, well, I'm really <laughs> doing this hanging? thing. I, I, um, okay. Uh, um, so the, the it, it's got it's got two syllables. The first syllable first syllable is something like an American would say if they're not they're not wanting to properly swear. So they'll say this. Oh man, you, this is not a good explanation. <laughs> I'll, I'll be honest with you. Uh, okay, um, uh, comic book character in um, in in the UK as a Scottish comic. Um, uh, he's desperate. Dan. Right. Dang. Dangling. Thank Dangling you very color? much. Excellent. Oh wow! Um, Dangling comma. So, uh, so, so you, you've um, uh, you, you you can call these in JavaScript functions. Yes, right. but but sometimes sometimes you just do that straight away. And immediately invoke fu function execution. Yes, uh, iffy. D yes, excellent. Thank you very much. Um, okay, so in uh, we have. Um, uh, dot window, you've got the, the window variable, you've got the self variable. Um, a new standard was made to join together what all Global this. Thank you very much. Um, all right, uh, so if you were, say, in the late 90s and you really wanted some music but didn't want to pay for it, you would use this <laughs> software. Kazar? Oh, Neely, uh, keep naming them. Uh, Oh, what was it called? Ah, oh, no, it begins with an S. Uh, no, okay. So, uh, so if, if you had a very short sleep, what would it be? A nap. Napster. Excellent. Thank you. Um, all right. So um, we've got Chrome, but like, if you want to use the nightly, it's called this. Uh, Canary. Yep. Excellent. Um, so if if you're starting a project with a a, a set of files, uh, you would call it this. It's also the name of a CSS framework. Uh, and all, all of the sites look the same because they all use this set of CSS. Bootstrap. Correct. Um, huh. Okay. Uh, so we uh, Blink um, came from WebKit, but WebKit came from Conqueror. And what was the render? HTML. Yes, absolutely. And we're out. Ooh. Oh wow, Summer, those I could, were absolutely. I'm I'm like Beastly. miles away, but I could basically hear you sweating. <laughs> oh, so difficult. I was really struggling with the dang dangling comma. I just couldn't. I couldn't think no, of. I thought. Any other I thought you were interlinters. I'd call it. I'd call it the trailing comma. Yeah, I call it trailing comma, but the... dangling comma works as well. Yeah, that's, that's that was a good one. I looked wow. it up. That's that's what that's what the the rule in Prettier is called. I'm just saying. Oh, fair I'm enough. Just saying. Fair enough. Fair enough. Today I learned. <sighs> well, chaps, well done. OK, we're going to play another game of charades. Surma is going to be describing to Jake. As always, he's not allowed to make any kind of noise, draw words or letters in the air or mouth the letters or any of that kind of stuff. So he has to stay completely silent uh, and describe the word of my choosing to Jake. I've sent the word across to Surma, uh, but he hasn't seen it yet. So he's about to see it for the first time. Try and describe it, for want of a better term, to Jake. And Jake's going to try and guess it 
Let's get ready. Gentlemen, are you ready for the Yeah. Contest? Yeah. Yeah. OK. On your marks, get set. Let's go. You're welcome. <laughs> I just Disappointed so FOMO. <laughs> Two words. First word. String. Yo-yo. Spiral. Circle. Uh, web. Web. Second word. Web bundle. Web package? Uh, oh, web. So, so that's like build? Web, web builder? It's not a bundle of web. Web tools? Web. Web, uh, web builder? Web construction? So! Web, oh. web construct? Web. Keep going! Web construction? <sighs> web constructor? A web builder. What web... is he doing? Come on, give me another clue. You need to, you need to work on. Need to... It's your fault, Summer, not mine. <laughs> it's great. I can insult him and he can't even like talk back. He's like, Summer, you're really bad at this. <laughs> you're dreadful. Uh, okay, so we've got. Uh, are we doing back or but? But. Second word. Second word is. <laughs> more more versions of the word but. I think he's going for here. Uh, web bottom. Uh, I mean, I only know the rude words, <laughs> apart from web, web. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, you are a rude word. Uh, web arse. <laughs> I am really not getting this. Like, so we've got, okay, so we're talking, right, we've got a big old web arse. A web arsenal, a web ar a big <laughs> web ar I'm I'm not enjoying myself right now. <laughs> what would be uh, an, an an American way of saying ass? Web ass. Right. Oh, what's he doing? Web web ass sim web assimilate three syllables. Web web ar web architecture. Web uh Web uh Web uh Web ass Web Web I don't know! I hate this! I'm not having fun anymore! <laughs> this was fun before! <laughs> I'm not enjoying this! Okay. <laughs> Web ass. Wait, wait, he's got it. No, I don't. I've got web assem. I'm kind of like repeating what you're saying. Web web assembly. Yes. Cool. yes! No. Oh. oh. That, that was. I hate everything because that's so obvious now. <laughs> ah. An emotional low point or high point, depending on who you are. Uh, I would like to say well done, but I think mm. well done, Surma. Uh, we'll leave it there. Okay, so it's time for a Wikipedia race. The idea is fairly straightforward. I start Surma and Jake off on one particular page of Wikipedia, and I give them another page that they have to get through by clicking on the links around Wikipedia. So the, the starting point that they have here is the Chrome disambiguation page on Wikipedia. So this is the, the Chrome page. So if you just type Chrome into Wikipedia, it'll ask you which Chrome you're talking about, and that's where they're starting. They don't know where they're headed yet. I haven't told them. Um, but you'll be able to see on screen both of their browsers. And the idea is the first one to get to the target page wins. Does that all make sense? Are you happy? Are you clear? I'm, yeah. I'm not happy, but it well, is I mean, clear. You, I was going to say, are you clear? Uh, not necessarily happy. All right. The page that you are going to go to, and I'll be obviously watching along, and uh, all the best to you both. The page that you need to get to is Empire State Building. Oh, thanks, mate. Oh, OK. okay. All right. I've got a plan. Uh, yeah, so, so straight into the browser. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Jake, have a look at it. Yeah, I'm um, okay. okay. And you're allowed to search, apparently. Yes, Control F is allowed. Yes. Okay. I'm. Um, 
All right. So, so this Empire, Empire State have... Building, right? Yep. Empire Menlo State Park. Building. So, so if I remember correctly, so the Empire State Building is in New York. It is. United States. Sam has got a great plan here. Yeah, well, I'm trying to Damn. do the same Server thing. has arrived. Oh, oh mate. Oh. That was Ooh. good work. OK, from Margaret Hamilton, uh -huh. your target page is Arctic Monkeys, the band. Arctic Monkeys. Oh, my word. Interesting first choice there by Paul. Ah. Oh, come on. We must have. OK. Um, ah, I see. Why do some of these Jake not have links? The this is really annoying me. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, I'm not even sure what it would be classed as. This is as. so upsetting. Um, I, I haven't even left them. Okay, Paul my, has my plan made is it to get up. across the ocean. Yeah, I'm, I'm stuck on. I have music. also. Uh, um, okay. Okay. I the am Beatles? now That's going to close, but not quite it. I know. I'm thinking if I can find <laughs> points of. Uh... Where where are no. they from? Arctic Monkeys? Are they uh, Sheffield? I don't know. Yes, they are. Oh, okay. Um, um, so. Ah, oh, that's some some very generous information sharing from Jake's was, side there. It was. It was. Not that it helps me because I I'm trying to. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Um, Ah, we have arrived at Sting also in terms know, of music. I know, I know, I know, and I'm still desperately trying to think. Uh, see, I have some in famous. In the meantime, Jake has arrived in Sheffield, but it doesn't seem to be very helpful. Come on, I mean Spice I'm Girls gonna... also I know. another good I, choice. Again, by Paul. I'm just hoping that somebody somewhere is going to reference the Arctic Monkeys from one of these famous musicians. I mean, the Spice Girls Arctic are Monkeys. infamously yes! inspired. Why does the I Sheffield? Can't... You got it. I was like, why does the Sheffield page not list the <laughs> bands from Sheffield? Like, there's loads of good bands yeah, on Sheffield. Oh, for, I'm clearly not listen, on quite the no, right for, Sheffield for page. For what it's worth, mate, you can get to Sheffield from the Arctic Monkeys, mate. You just click it. There you go. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. See, and now I'm on the proper Sheffield page. I bet it's like, I bet the Arctic Monkeys. There they are. <laughs> ah. Well, that was good Ugh. knowledge. I hate this game. I hate this game so much. I'm not having fun. <laughs> it is time for a teculate. Gentlemen, are you ready? <sighs> I'm already sweating. I'll take that as a I, yes. I'm, just, I'm already in game <laughs> mode. I'm just concentrating. All right. <laughs> get the game faces on. On your marks, get set, explain. Okay. Oh, oh Serma, this is uh, if you did brain surgery on something uh, to. And then the second. Word would be New a kind network? of bir a bird, a kind of bird. Night, it flies at night, and it's uh, it's known for rotating its head all the way round. An owl, right? What that's the second word, and the, the first one would be brain surgery to kind of. Uh, uh, oh, the lobotomized owl. Yes. Um, okay, it's the standards body. W three C. Correct. Okay, it's a really old programming language from like nineteen fifties, nineteen sixties. It's the kind of thing you think of mainframes. Cobol. Correct. Um, this one would be an old uh, way of connecting to a monitor to a PC, for example. Oh, VGA? Uh, slightly newer. Uh, DVI. Right, and now expand it to what you'd actually call it. It is a DVI what? Plug, socket, cable. Keep going. Yes, there you go, DVI cable. DVI Plug cable. Oh, Serma! Right, an old way of archiving that you'd have done uh, on uh, uh Windows. No, nope. oh, WinRAR. Yes, brilliant. Love it. Okay, yeah. Um, right, the standard that you write all your markup in. Yeah, but then yeah. add a letter on the front. That's again a little bit on the older end. The standard that I write all my markup in. Like so, so what mark? do you write your markup in? What do you write your markup in? VS Code. No, as in text. What's the? the yeah, but what's it actually known as? The standard for writing. You've got JavaScript, Common CSS, mark. and JavaScript, CSS, and what? JavaScript, CSS, and HTML. Right. Put another letter on the front. XHTML. Another one. Keep going. It's, it makes it exciting and moving and Oh, washing. DHTML. DHTML. Perfect. Perf perfect. Right. Now, you know when you do uh, thing and thing and thing, and that's really annoying. So there's a new operator that lets you just check. Oh, no. <laughs> and it's a, it's a question mark. It's, a, it's the nullish coalescing operator? Yes. 
Brilliant. Okay. Um, Apple have a connector of this type um, with the lightning. Other... Keep going. Another one. Uh, oh, it, it... Thunderbolt. Perfect. Okay. Going back to the standards body, um, but... there's a different layers of of readiness for specs. Uh, uh, editor's so... draft. There's perfect recommendation. That's it. That's it. Oh, excellent. Yeah. All right. The one that's up from Uno is a Duo. Brilliant. And well yes! done. Well done. Oh. <laughs> oh. You did very, very, was, very well some, with those. There were some lucky stabs in the dark there, like with COBOL and whatever. Like I was I was not I was expecting to have to list like a ton of all programming languages, but yeah, that was uh... The oh. I think DHTML was surprisingly difficult to land. Um Yeah, I was thinking like SHTML and all of that sort of uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> But, but you crushed it with... with I like, didn't enjoy you, you dancing around with a lobotomized owl. I, that was very that enjoyable. That was very good. I have, I've never heard of it. What is that? I need to go on. Do I need to Google that? I'm not sure. It's a CSS selector. Star plus star. Yeah. It's called the lobotomized owl. Today I learned. Ladies and gentlemen, we have another Wikipedia race coming up right now. Are your chaps ready? Yes. Yep. Your target page is... Standard deviation. Standard oh, deviation. I hate you. Um, right, I was hoping there'd be something about mathematics, uh, but there isn't. So let's go with JavaScript. Math. Um, ah, math. I see. Okay. It's got, uh, we're doing exactly the same thing. There's code samples. Very helpful no, to find other mathematics-related articles. Yeah, but it's not, not, it's not really helping because they're not linked to the word math or math. I mean, that would be. Oh, no. Why is all right. Okay, I'm going to try. I see both math. participants are engaging in wild control effing. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, this is this is hard. Um, we have arrived at Java, ah! which is not that big of a. I went to Java and then I came back because I really am struggling. Hang on, I've got to go to standard deviation, right? Jake deviation. has arrived at Lua, oh, no... which is also a questionable oh. choice at this point. <laughs> yeah. Reading about the syntax of Lua. Ah. Um, uh. Ah, we are slowly abstracting uh, from concrete languages to abstract concepts. Maybe, maybe oh, this is the way to go. To why is right? I'm I'm going off the wall. Just this is this is it. I'm in the Department of Computer and Science, University of Cambridge. This, it this might is lead it. you to say, Who knows? Paul. What? Paul I, is still comparing okay, languages. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. I thought you got it then. Um, no. Have you? Ah, uh, looking for the word math in the article about math ML. That's yeah, but that that was that was fine. I've got I've gone to mathematics uh, standard. Oh come on! How do you get? How do you not have standard deviation in mathematics? Right, that uh, that statistics. is a good question. Maybe something worth editing on the Wikipedia page. Ah, uh, we have arrived. Pause our yeah. statistics. That seems like it's fairly close. The pressure is on for Jake. Standard deviation. Where's my mouse cursor? Yes! Oh, that was no! such a close call. But it was just fast enough to deny Jake I, his I, only chance at winning. Yes! I hate you so much. I hate you so much. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy I denied you the victory. I mean, oh, bad uh, that was a tough. Good fight. Good fight. Good fight. <laughs> I think this one is complete rubbish. So you have to get to the Wikipedia page, landfill. Off you go. Oh, rubbish. Ooh. Yes. OK. Um, uh, OK, I'm going to go with just. I am just like I'm impressed at how quickly uh, some moves around pages. I can see why I just lost this uh, terribly. Um, OK. What are your strategies? I'm uh, trying to. Oh, I'm not telling that. I'm not going to. <laughs> <laughs> well, that makes me a very boring video. Let's all just sit here in silence. Then, I'm trying until to go finds the page. via agriculture, but for some reason, oh yes, there is no dedicated link. Landfill got there. What? Oh, Ooh. I'm so happy with that. Tell me yes! your path. How, how did you do it? What was Tell your, me your path. okay? Let's go backwards. I'm gonna have to rewind this. I'm actually quite pleased with this uh, path that I went through. I went Web 2.0. Went to JavaScript library, yep. to JavaScript, to V8, the yep. JavaScript engine, figuring, garbage yeah. collection. No now way that, that worked. Then, oh! So that then yeah, that led me to the disambiguation, because it has a disambiguation click at the top. 
So I went to the disambiguation page, the top one, garbage collection or waste collection is part of municipal waste um, management. Brilliant, great. So then I went to waste collection and there is landfill. And I went That's incredible. Through to that landfill. is a path I would not have thought would ever work. So do, you deserve that win. That was well I'm done. So yeah, that was absolutely amazing. Unbelievably chuffed with that one. Yes. <laughs> well Thank done. You. So we have been filming these little interstitial videos uh, all day um, and we are running out of ideas and patience. Uh, so we've come up with a, a final game, a final game. And what we're going to do is we're going to see how long we can not blink for. <laughs> was that was that the correct grammar to use? Not really, but the words were all there. You just have to make them work for yourself. Don't blink any of us for as long as possible. If we miss a little mini blink, then, you know, I'm sure I'm sure everybody will hold us to the high standards of honesty that we expect from ourselves here. So Absolutely. you know how I'm trying, hyper, I'm trying to get in a quarter of blinks. Yeah, that's that's I was just saying, you know how you how you hyperventilate before diving because it allows you to hold your breath longer. I wonder if oh. the same thing applies to blinking. If you hyperblink, hyperblink, you get yeah. There's going to be somebody right. out there who's going. That's the worst thing to do. They've all yeah. completely. You just lost their three years of your lifespan uh, or something. Especially with a big light in my in my face here as well. Yeah, okay, here we go. Are you, are you ready? Are you ready? I, I think so. Uh, yes. Okay. I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. Oh, I kind of went for a, a huge eye open at the start there, which I feel like I might have. Uh... I blinked. <laughs> well, you've uh, got to be rubbish at something. Yeah. Well, my I'll eyes just... twitching. Yeah. Moving your eyes oh, is I, fine. Really... This is really hard. Mm. Oh, you would think this would be easier than this, but my eyes are like properly stinging now. <laughs> yeah, I, I, so... I, I just enjoy uh... watching your frozen faces staring uh, into the camera. Uh, so the light, the light is drying out your eyes as well. It is because like, I mean, obviously to film this, we've got like a huge, well, I've got a huge light right there. So have I. And yep. it's like, oh, I blinked, I blinked. Ah! I... I've still not blinked yet. I'm, I'm going for, I think I haven't anyway. I'm just go oh, there you go. Okay, I did. Uh, oh. yeah. that, was, <laughs> that was the nicest blink well, I've ever had. Unless, unless I'm much mistaken. <laughs> I don't think I blinked there throughout. Um, I'd be interested to, to, I might just watch that back for myself at some point. It turns out that <laughs> you have a recording that you can rewatch on loop I, of you. I'm just blown away. This might well, be one of the most uncomfortable gifts we can make. <laughs> just, <laughs> just staring. And oh, judging. Dear. Well, we're definitely out of ideas then. So uh, yeah, yeah, that's enough from us.